Hello, AI enthusiasts. Welcome to today's AI News Roundup brought to you by AI. I'm your host, Babs, and I've got the latest updates on artificial intelligence developments from around the world. Let's dive in. Our news for today includes Claude versus ChatGPT 2024 comparison, AI trends for workers 2024, next AI regulation 2024, and businesses monetize AI. Let's delve into the stories. GPT-4 and Claude are leading AI applications that use generative AI. GPT-4, supported by OpenAI and Microsoft, is a versatile app that creates articles, code, and performs various tasks. Claude, supported by Google, Zoom, and Slack, is mainly used as an AI chatbot with focused use cases. In a head-to-head -head comparison, GPT-4 offers better long-form content, data processing, image interpretation and integration, while Claude excels in programming accuracy and specific use cases like legal analysis. Both have their strengths and weaknesses in terms of accuracy and security. GPT-4 has a pricing scale based on tokens, while Claude offers subscription plans with different performance levels. Overall, GPT-4 wins in terms of features, but Claude may be better for narrower AI chatbot use cases. Pricing-wise, Claude 2 comes out ahead. Pros and cons are highlighted for both applications. The influence of artificial intelligence is set to make a bigger impact in 2024, with trends including widespread inclusivity, more equitable hiring and layoffs, diversity-centered hiring and training, upskilling opportunities, and struggles with AI regulation. Workers are ready to embrace the changes, but concerns about job protections and industry shifts remain. The key takeaway is that AI in the workplace is here to stay and both employees and businesses will need to adapt rapidly. In 2023, AI policy and regulation gained mainstream attention with significant developments in the U.S., Europe, and China. In the U.S., President Biden's executive order on AI set the stage for more transparency and sector-specific regulation, while the EU passed the world's first sweeping AI law, the AI Act, with strict requirements for high-risk AI systems. China's approach to AI regulation has been fragmented, but a comprehensive AI law is on the legislative agenda. Other parts of the world, including Africa, are also expected to introduce more AI regulations. The global landscape of AI regulation is evolving, with different approaches and priorities shaping the future of AI governance. In the rapidly evolving business landscape, AI is reshaping how businesses operate and compete. However, many companies are struggling to monetize AI applications. The solution lies in usage-based metering, quoting and forecasting, and modern billing. By leveraging AI's ability to process data and offer hyper-personalization, companies can monetize customer service and increase engagement. The key is to emphasize fairness, transparency, and alignment between service providers and customers. AI is a transformative technology that will become standard fare, and companies that successfully implement long-term monetization strategies will be the lasting winners. All right, folks, that's a wrap for today's AI News Roundup. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and subscribe for more daily updates. And if you want to catch up on any news you might have missed, check out one of the other videos on screen. As always, thanks for tuning in, and remember, I'm not an AI with a sense of humor, but why did the robot go on a diet? It had too many bites. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.